Well, it means that the U.S. Postal Service is working to make sure that these blue collection boxes are going to be a lot harder for thieves to break into and steal the mail inside. After repeated calls for change. You know, we want to come to work, go home after work and, you know, be safe. The U.S. Postal Service is taking steps to protect letter carriers and make mail tougher to steal. Obviously, there's a shortage of workers. You know, if I feel like next thing we know, we're not going to have anybody to deliver the mail. The Postal Service now says it'll install 12,000 so-called high-security blue collection boxes nationwide in areas considered high risk. The agency will also replace those so-called arrow keys with electronic locks. Arrow keys are the master keys to open any collection boxes in a particular zip code. Thieves are using the keys to get into the box to steal cash and checks sent through the mail. The National Postal Police Officers Association has been advocating for the change. They have to replace these arrow keys. Um, you know, it's the 21st century. Let, let's replace this antiquated technology and let's get some sort of electronic uh, interface that can be deactivated, that can be tracked. Um, and you have to put postal police back out on the street. At least three Milwaukee mail carriers have been robbery targets this year. The most recent last month in the Cooper Park neighborhood. Are they on edge right now? Yes, they're concerned. And Caroline, this is a national initiative. Milwaukee, not the only place where thieves are targeting the mail. Right, according to the Postal Service, nationally, more than 300 letter carriers have been robbed this year. More than 25,000 of these blue collection boxes have been uh, robbed as well, Derek. And there, we're working to find out if Milwaukee is going to be one of those areas that the Postal Service is targeting uh, to harden up some of these postal boxes as well.